Hello guys, welcome to this video and today I'm going to teach you how you can do this kind of like isometric graphics that you can do here in Flash for your websites or for your animations, for your drawings. It's actually really simple. So the good thing about Flash, as you may know, is that we work with vectors instead of with pixels. So you can create like really clean looking, like really professional looking graphics. And the way that we're going to do this, as you're seeing on the screen right now, is that we're going to create a grid, okay? First of all, we're going to create like a grid. So just follow the steps that you're seeing in the screen. This is like pre-recorded. That's why it's going so fast. I'm just trying to like explain what's going on, right? So first of all, we create this grid. And then on top of the grid, in a new layer, is that we're going to start actually drawing our graphics or our building or whatever we want to do right and this is going to serve as a guide as you're going to see in a second this is like a guide for the perspective and to keep everything really in the same you know in the same perspective everything really professional looking and it's really easy actually so what we have to do once we have this this grid here we have to create a new layer on top of it and we have to block the layer that the grid is on so we don't modify it or anything. And just with the line tool, we start drawing, as you can see. We start drawing our figure, following the lines. All we have to do is follow the lines, right? Because if you follow the lines like I'm showing you right now, that's the perspective, sorry, <laughs> that's the perspective, okay? That's the isometric perspective that you have right there. It's really easy, okay? Once you, it might take a little bit of practice in the beginning, but once you get used to it, it's really easy. So, yeah. And once you're done and you fill everything in, you just have to double click the line that you have, you know, you double click the borders and then you click delete to get rid of it. And you just get the, this very cool looking, like very clean, figure as you can see so yeah that was all thanks you guys for watching i hope this was really helpful i think this is one of the most cool things that you can do in in flash yeah thank you for watching and see you on the next ones